possibly getting an upset in this bracket. I we will see them next week, though. I want to see them come back. Absolutely. I, I definitely want to watch that final stock and just watch how long both players went without taking a hit. That, that was such easily careful 40 neutral. Seconds. But, I mean, I don't think that's going to be something we're seeing in this set as we have Carflow now coming up in loser semis against Fawn. And this is a player who just wants to get in there and hit the buttons. You are going to be hit when you fight Carflow. Roy, Krom, Carflow only knows one thing and it's to inflict pain so on others. So this is a run back from earlier in the bracket today. Fawn advanced over Carflow with Wario. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is a run back. All right, Carflow looking to get their revenge against Pawn, and so far it's looking like revenge will be theirs as they take the first stock. Yep, only 25%. Pawn not able to find any of those huge combo starters. Meanwhile, Carflow continuing on this pressure. All right, has to take the high recovery with the air dodge. Pawn not quite ready for it, and Carflow able to plant his feet and just continue this damage. Plant his feet. He's been up in the air the whole time. Uh, he's, he's just everywhere. It's just as soon as as soon as Carflow is able to find his way out of disadvantage off the side, like it's it's just a, a whole scary character. Yeah, that thirty eight percent that Fawn did first stock took it very personally. Apparently. You're not gonna touch me again until until the second stock. Carflow is saying, I'm, here. "I'm not losing another game to this warrior. Who do you think I am?" Carflow. Oh, oh! Fawn looking for a roll in, not quite finding it. Very tricky blazer coming out from Carflow, keeping it, keeping things ambiguous with the platform Ooh. jab, F smash, and we might be seeing a game oh, taken no! before Waft is even available. Carflow with the three stock. Fawn just wants that run back. Like no, 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 can't do that, it like that. That didn't, that didn't happen. Uh, that was a button check, I think. <laughs> it's a mulligan. Yeah. Do you think we're going to go Duck Hunt? If they, if they did win with Wario before, I think they're going to be confident with sticking with Wario. Even after that very fast game one. Oh, all right. Uh, Fawn's got the Wario where yeah. music counter pick. So I am thinking we are continuing with the Wario. I'm going to be honest. I could never... Um, I can never listen to the song without thinking about that mashup, like, I don't bug with you. I love that mashup! I think about that every time. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's see if Fawn is able to make things happen here in game two. Already getting a little bit more percent than we saw in game one, but Carflow just cannot be stopped. It uh, looks Ooh. like Vaughn is actually adapting quite well to this matchup. It took him a little bit, especially after playing uh, with uh, Duck Hunt Dog. I feel like this is kind of what's happening here, at least what we've seen in Vaughn, with Vaughn in Bracket today, is if they... So <laughs> <laughs> Even Vaughn, Vaughn like, was what? surprised that hit. I feel Vaughn like was pogging. <laughs> oh, no. They're going to make it back. He's going to no make way. it back with the double jump, but almost getting caught by the spike hitbox of the down air. All right, roll back. All, All right, Fawn punishing appropriately. Yep, even with the air dodge, Fawn still able to find these openings. Oh, no. Ooh, we're just dancing around the platform right now. Fawn is able to find the grab and put Carflow back at the ledge. This should be a stock potentially no, unfortunately. Not with that invulnerable blazer. Yep, even with the tech, Fawn finds herself getting side beat, and that, that'll just kill anyone. Exactly. Oh, no. Shield looking real low for Fawn right now. I'd be very careful. Fawn hasn't even had a chance to get even one inch of waft on. No, we are still, still what a 20 chase. seconds away from full waft. All right, this could be Fawn's last tournament stock. Woo! All right, Carflow getting the chance to play with the bike a little bit. Oh, it's coming. No. Oh, getting a little sneaky with it, but not not really amounting to anything as Fawn is able to find the back throw. All right, trying to call it a jump. stock yet. <gasps> waft is online, but it would be a bit of a waste oh. to do it now. All right. Get that down tilt uh, dash attack. This is an even game. Yeah, yeah, I'd say Fawn is, Fawn is like 
two hits away from taking taking game two. Whereas Carflow may only be one. Does get the no grab, grab, but that's not it's not too <gasps> much. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Yo! Mm, off the wrong side though! Oh my gosh, that was it! Uh-oh. How's your shield looking though? Just needs a shield poke. Unless. Nope. Yep, and finding the up air. Oh. Carflow <laughs> taking it 2-0 over Fawn. All smiles. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that though. Like you said, it was the wrong side. If that hit the other direction, it would have been over. We'd be in game three. Right? I mean, that just goes to show how much more optimization that Fawn needs to do with that character in order to bring it up to the level of their Duck Hunt, their Bayo, and even their Game & Watch, I would say. Oh, I think this is the... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to freeze frame on that. Oh, do you want me to go back to that one? Yeah, can we please? I want to see that Pog. All right, hold on, let's see here. Into... <laughs> yeah! Same! That's a new emote right there for the channel. Same. All right. But we do have Carflow moving on into Loser's Finals to face...